Hi, I'm Debbie, and welcome to my channel, Divine Destiny with Debbie. Today we're reading for March 20th, 21st, and 22nd, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday for my Aries. Happy birthday, my Aries. Well, this is the weekend reading, so I start, well, I use my two Radley Valentine decks. I start with my Angel Tarot cards for the main message, and then I try to pull one from my Archangel Power Tarot cards. I have prayed, meditated, and infused both decks with Reiki energy. But remember, this is a general reading. It may or may not resonate. Take what you like. Leave the rest. Happy birthday to my Aries. It's, it's your birthday season, and it's an interesting time to be alive. But I do feel that we need to just keep our, you know, we, we need to um, stay hopeful. We need to stay positive. So let's see what we have here. Remember, I am an intuitive channeler, and what that means is that I open myself up to my higher power spirit, and whatever the message is that needs to come out, it comes on out. Now, three cards are face down. The middle one is reversed. Reversed energy, reversed cards to me means a little stronger energy. Okay, so let's see what we have for my Aries for the weekend. Here, first card up is the star. Make a wish. Your birthday season has has began has begun. Now I know that there's going to be some, you know, there's going to be some ups and downs. We're not, you know, that's what's going on in the world. There will always be ups and downs in our lives. But this weekend starts really positive for you. This is Archangel energy. This is make a wish, happy times. So you know, even though you know there's going to be a spirit of optimism for you. Now is that because there's things going on? that, you know, may, you know, that may be pulling that energy in for you, and it could be that, too. Or maybe it's because you just know that innately that there are better things ahead. Now, I know, again, stay positive, thoughts, words. So the star is Archangel Jophiel. Happy times make positive, optimistic, long-term plans on the right path. So with that, to me, it's like, you know, you need to see beyond. You need to see beyond what's going on now in the world. This card is reversed. Here we go. The four of air. Air energy is our Aquarius. Now we have Saturn going into Aquarius. I think it's that 22nd. Also, it is Gemini and it is Libra energy. Thought processes, you could be hearing news. Now this is talking about, you know, it, 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 this is talking about kind of separating yourself. So even though, you know, even though things are, are going to work out for you and that they are okay for you, this is about separating yourself. This is taking a vacation. This is time to rest or take a vacation. Allow more time before making a decision. Meditation may provide answers. So you could be, you know, basically this is kind of staying, you know, is this staying home? Probably it's staying home. It's separating yourself and... You know, and, but with this too, I want you, my Aries, to make sure you keep that connection with your higher power, guardian angel, spirit guide, voice of the universe, really strong, okay? Your last card here is the seven of water. Water energy is our Cancer Pisces Scorpio fluid. It's emotional. So yeah, there's got to be, so, so it's an interesting here. It's like your thought processes are like, okay, I have to stay away. I have to separate myself, yet at the same time you're entering into the, well this is the start of the astrological season, your season, but it's also start of, you know, staying hopeful, connection, 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 but this is about it, this is more of that emotional, so, so there may be some decision making you have to make, you have to do this weekend, especially with everything that's going on. Maybe you're going to have to say, you know, many people are closing businesses, many people are you know, you know, um, you know, and that might be more the case for you. Maybe you're going to have to make that decision, and it's not necessarily going to be an easy decision because, yeah, there's a financial component. But your star, Archangel Joe Field, says it will work out for it will work out okay for you. So, the Seven of Water is a complex decision. The need to do research, stop procrastinating. So yeah, there's there's all there's there's a couple of conflicting energies here for you, but the overall one I'm going to go with the Archangel energy, the Star, happy times, making positive, optimistic, long-term plans on the right path. Now, let's go on and see what we have here now. 
and okay one more time we will shuffle okay one more just okay that's good here we go let's see what our archangel power tarot cards have to say face down the nine of Gabriel. Okay, your energy, fire energy, strong, passionate, but you know, determined, burning type of energy. And this is basically, even though, even though you know you have your four of air saying kind of separate, even though you have the emotional, almost emotional turbulence going around you, you know, you still have that star, but also the nine of Gabriel, your energy, Leo and um, Sagittarius energy. It's basically saying, stay determined and move forward. Be prepared for any possibility environmental activism. So, so there's a, you know, again, too, this is the times that we're living in. I, you know, I'd love to be able to say that this is going to be, you know, I mean, you know, and maybe you're not being affected by what's going on. And then in that case, then there's still going to be that internal, that internal, um, you know, that emotional struggle going on making, you know, what am I going to do type of thing. But the star and nine of Gabriel are very positive, saying stay on course, you know, continue. You might have to take a little bit of a backtrack. You know, you might have to, if you have a business, you might have to close that for a little bit of time. But, you know, it. I do feel that the rebound will be on the positive side because, again, we're starting your season with the star, okay? And nine of Gabriel... Stay determined. So I know it is what it is. We live in interesting times. So my Aries, if you enjoy my readings, remember down there, please like, share, subscribe. But as always, my Aries, know that you are loved, be safe, and be blessed. Bye-bye.